Here's a little Vancouver secret. Beneath the skyline, the volcanic past of Vancouver is hiding in plain sight, and the story will surprise you. Take Queen Elizabeth Park, up on Little Mountain. Around 31 to 34 million years ago, magma intruded and formed basalt rock. This hill wasn't a classic volcano cone, but volcanic activity nonetheless. Then swing by Siwash Rock, or Schla Hilsch, Standing Man, in Stanley Park. About 32 million years ago, a volcanic dike forced magma into sedimentary rock and hardened into basalt. The surrounding softer rock eroded away and left that iconic sea stack. But here's the twist. Vancouver isn't built on the remains of one massive erupting volcano. Instead, what you're seeing are the remnants of volcanic plumbing, intrusions, dikes, float, plus glacial sculpting, plus sediment, fill that shaped the land. The volcano wasn't dramatic in the usual sense, but its quieter processes left traces that still define our city today. So, next time you're at Queen Elizabeth Park, or staring at Siwash Rock, you're looking at volcanic echoes, a living landscape of fire, ice, and time. Let me tell you.